The importance of community, why is vital to your journey. You work harder when somebody's watching, you build a bond because nobody's meant to be alone, and you gotta understand that the bigger the community, the bigger the gossip. So guys, before I go on, give this video a like, hit the subscribe button. So starting with number one, you think about being in a room. Now I wanna challenge you to look around you and look at the other people and see the coach, hear your name getting yelled at when you're at Fit Club, and tell me that, that that's not making you work harder. So I wanna challenge you to do this workout from home. I want you to give me three rounds, 30 seconds on with the 10 second break, and we're gonna do four exercises. We're gonna do push-ups, we're going to do squats, we're going to do burpees, and we're going to do tricep dips. If you need to do modifications, so be it. 30 on, three rounds, 10 seconds in between each exercise. Now do that workout, which is a very small workout, and see how motivated you are to do it all by yourself at your home in your basement. And then what I want you to do is compare it. Literally take notes and compare it to how you work when you're on the blue. When you have somebody watching, not just the coach, but other members, and they might not even be looking at you, but you're gonna feel the pressure when somebody's working their ass off next to you for you to work harder. So the importance of community is that having people that are pushing themselves around you is going to naturally push you. Number two is that you build a bond with the community because nobody is meant to be alone, right? There's always an A to a B. So no matter how stubborn we are and how much we get into our own head and that we think that we don't need anybody, there's always going to be a time when we need somebody else. And it might not be an actual human connection because people go off to the jungle or they go to the forest by themselves and what are they trying to do? They're trying to connect with nature. That's still trying to create a bond. And so when you come to Fit Club and you get involved with the community, then you understand that this journey isn't just about me. You might be there for your own results, but having other people supporting you and having people in your corner, that's going to help you push through those very tough days. And the last but not least is that as your community grows, so does the gossip, right? But as soon as we understand that we all love a good drama show, the best shows, the best movies on TV are those the ones that have drama. This life is not always going to be about cake and cookies, rainbows and butterflies. There's going to be times when we're going to get knocked down. There's going to be times where we're going to feel like we're being held down and we're going to feel like we're not being supportive. But the more that we realize that, that not everybody is going to be perfect and that everybody has their own mindset and that everybody has their own journey, the faster that we can get over it and the faster that we can connect with other people and then we can confront these problems and so that we can grow deeper and further as a family. Because I believe that when it comes to gossip or comes to hard times, I always want to confront this person or confront the situation, but confront it with love. The other day I confronted somebody with a social media post and I said to this individual, I said, hey, listen, are you sure that this is something that you want to put on social media? Now, Deep in my soul, I didn't want to say anything because of the fact that I was like, this could make this person turn on me, right? But I said, you know what? If I'm gonna have this relationship with this person moving forward, and if I actually consider us family, then I have to say something, but I'm gonna say it in a loving way. And if this person doesn't accept the way that I see it, and they just want to accept the way that they're seeing it, I'm not going to get mad at this person. I'm not going to look at this person any differently. It's just something that we're going to agree to disagree. We're never always going to 100% agree. Now, in the end, we're still friends. We're still talk. And actually, I feel more connected to that person now because I confronted this situation, but I confronted with love because it's not always an all-in or all-out situation. So my recommendation to you that as this community grows and we understand that as we add more people, they're gonna have different personalities, they're going to have different views, that if in the end we are a true family and you want this to be your home forever, then we have to understand that everybody has their different perspectives, but most importantly, we have these discussions so that we can grow together. But even when we have these discussions, even if we don't agree, that doesn't change on how we look or feel about that person it just grows us stronger as a family because we were able to have that discussion. So community is so important and I want you to be a part of this community. And if you're already a current member, I want you to help 
and grow into this community. I don't want you to be your fake self. I want you to be your real self. If you are crazy, you make a lot of noise, or you, you create a lot of like drama around this, that's fine, then that's who you are. But we also have to understand that if we get confronted, that if somebody brings something up with us, that we can't be offended. And if we do get offended, that we have to be able to move on and move over it quickly so that we can continue to grow as a family. So continue to work hard, be that person in the room that you're motivating others plus yourself so that you can continue to grow in the workouts but also outside the workouts. Understand that we're here on our own mission but we're bonded together by one thing which is fitness. And understand that gossip is good because it's good to talk about each other but it's good to talk to each other behind but also in front and we need to come up with a resolution so that we can continue to grow and this is our family forever. So before you go guys, give the video a like. If you haven't subscribed yet, hit subscribe. If you're looking to get started, five days for five bucks, send us a message. Or if you're a current member and you're looking to really take those results to the next level, get on the list for the next belly burden.